Hello and welcome to our Unit 3, uh, number 10 activity, which is understanding your learning style. And in this activity, we're going to focus on page border. Uh, we're also going to focus on uh, demonstrating find and replace. We're going to look at placing our titles and our subtitles in the center um, of alignment. And then we're also going to indent our paragraphs. So let's get started. First, we're going to go and we have already gone and typed or recreated the document I asked you to recreate. So you should all have this by now. Now, at this point, it's important that you don't put your cursor down here or somewhere else. It has to be right here where I have mine. Now next what we're going to do is we're going to go to where it says insert and we're going to come down to where it says drawing and we're going to choose new. And in this section here what you want to do is we're going to look for the rectangle tool and that will this one right here. And then we're going to draw a rectangle just like so. And I think the best bet would be to keep it between the one inch and the eight inch. We're gonna to wanna to get rid of this part in the middle and we're gonna to wanna to make that transparent. That is very important. The next item is making this line thicker so we can see it. So we're gonna make that eight. Then we're gonna to come to our border color and you can choose whichever color you like. Uh, you do want to have something that is able to be seen. So I would like you to choose one of these colors in here that's darker. I'm going to choose the blue. And then you would just choose save and close when you're finished. And once you are done, you're going to notice that your words automatically pushed down. Now, to see your whole document, the best thing to do would be to drop this to 50. You will click on your blue area just like I have done here with the border, with our blue border. And then I'm going to bring that down so it's the size of the page. I'm going to see how far I can get that up here as well. And it looks like I have it at its most. Now at this point, we need this right here to be clicked. That will bring our text up. Now we have to go in and adjust the text. To do this, we just simply have to increase and go to our 100 again and come over to where our cursor is in front of those stars and just press enter until they are in it. Now, once they are in, we can then see if we can't adjust this to make it a little bit wider. And it does allow us. Once you're done with this, go ahead and go on to the next video.